Introducing the Tupperware Supersonic Chopper Extra, where speed, efficiency, and incredible results come together to solve one of the most important pain points in every kitchen, chopping. We all know the struggle of chopping vegetables by hand. The time-consuming process, the inconsistent results, and the fatigue that sets in just after a few minutes. But fear no more. This chopper will become your go-to food processor to help you breeze through chopping, mixing, and blending just by pulling the handle with no electricity required. It's time to unlock your creativity and explore a whole new world of culinary possibilities. Let's review the product details. The ergonomic design of the cover makes it easier to hold while using. The reinforced pull cord will always remain in place thanks to the oval-shaped grommet, which allows automatic alignment. And the symmetrical handle guarantees comfortable usage for left and right-handed users. The cover always stays securely in place while in use, thanks to the bayonet mechanism that attaches the cover to the base. On the extra, the cover attaches to a special adapter ring and the adapter ring to the base. There is a very important pictogram on the cover to remind you to always have one hand pushing down the chopper on the countertop to keep it stable while in use. The cover's push and twist system allows for easy one twist disassembly and reassembly. Easy to use and easy to clean. The angled surface of the bottom cover with no rim makes the chopper easy to clean. The central connection makes it easy to align the bottom cover with the top blade insert and is designed to securely hold the blade in place while in use. On the blade attachment, you will find a blade protector that includes a flap to keep it in place while not in use. The blades are made out of stainless steel 420, which stays sharp longer and resists rust and corrosion while providing precision cuts every time. The blade insert for the Extra has three sharp curved blades that allow quick and thorough chopping. Cutting at an angle reduces resistance and makes it easier to chop large quantities. The top of all the blade inserts are closed to keep food from getting stuck when adding ingredients into the base during the chopping process. The paddle insert can be used to mix batters, sauces, and dressings in no time. The special design ensures all the mixing is done fast and properly. The paddle insert allows great versatility and allows you to effortlessly achieve the precise results you desire. For instance, you can start to chop delicate herbs and onions into coarse pieces using the blade insert. Then seamlessly transition to the paddle insert as you add the remaining ingredients for a delectable dressing. With the gentle power of the paddle, you can expertly combine everything to perfection without fully blending the onions and herbs. The transparent base makes it easy to check your preparations at each step and have easy to read capacity markings with a maximum fill line. The base has a central pin to ensure the blade insert is placed centrally during chopping. There is also a removable anti-skid ring to keep the chopper stable on the countertop while in use. The special adapter ring that fits the cover to the base also has a recess for the funnel insert that allows the hole of the funnel to open or close, which is indicated by the pictogram on the funnel. The soft cap covers the recess when the funnel is not being used. The funnel features an easy dosing system of up to 50 milliliters that allows you to measure and add liquids during your preparation without opening the cover. A massive amount of work has been done by the Tupperware Research and Development team when developing the supersonic choppers. They evaluated more than 20 types of cords, executed outside endurance tests of up to 100,000 cycles for cords and springs, conducted 1,000 hours of testing, and 1,200 hours spent on 206 technical drawings. All this ensures the supersonic choppers are one of the best manual food processors in the world. To assemble, carefully remove the blade protector from the blades by pulling up and gently unfolding the flap that locks the blade protector and lifting the blade insert while holding it from the top. Begin by grasping the blade insert from the top and carefully placing it on the central pin of the base. 
align the press button of the top cover with the beginning of the arrow picto marked in the inner part of the bottom cover. You know it's in place once you don't see the button anymore and there is no gap between both covers. Twist the covers in opposite directions until you see the red button. Hold the chopper base firmly and screw the adapter ring on the base and then the cover in a clockwise direction until it locks onto the adapter ring by the bayonet closure. The family size extra chopper chops larger quantities of vegetables and fruits. The blade insert can be used to prepare salsa, guacamole, gazpacho, and more. The paddle insert is ideal to prepare cake batter, mayonnaise, and mousse. You can also prepare recipes where you start with the blade insert and end with the paddle to prepare dressings, omelets, batters, and more. No more dirty hands, tears, or frustration. For optimal chopping results and to avoid damaging the product, here are the recommended maximum quantity per type of ingredients. It is important to respect the maximum fill line, otherwise some ingredients won't be chopped efficiently. If needed, divide the food and chop in two batches. The result will be better than overfilling. Cut larger ingredients into pieces three centimeters in length to avoid blocking the blades. For medium-sized ingredients, such as onions, divide into four pieces for medium-sized onions and eight pieces for larger ones. Same for other ingredients similar in size and shape. Hard ingredients such as Parmesan cheese or ginger should be cut into one centimeter cubes. Always use a supersonic chopper on a countertop or dry stable surface. Make sure the blade insert is inside the base before adding ingredients. To chop, secure the cover, hold it firmly by placing one hand on it and pull the cord in fast straight movements with the other hand. Start directly to pull in fast movements so the mechanism does not get stuck. For best results when chopping dry ingredients, pull the cord three to four times, then shake the chopper using both hands before continuing. Our supersonic choppers are awesome, so a few pulls will get you really far, or in this case, really fine. So we recommend checking the results after every other pull as you get used to using your chopper. You'll soon learn how many pulls you need in order to reach your desired results, coarse or fine. Remove the cover and blade insert carefully before removing the chopped food. To clean your chopper, first disassemble the cover with clean, dry hands. When you first get your product, it may require some force in your fingers to remove the cover, but it will get easier over time. Let me show you how. Remove the cover from the adapter ring by firmly holding the ring and unscrewing the bayonet in a counterclockwise direction until it is unlocked. Hold the cover with both hands and push the red button with your thumb. At the same time, twist the upper and bottom cover in opposite directions. The red button should follow the direction of the arrow to the unlock picto. Lift the upper cover. Never allow the pull cord to get wet as this can cause long-term damage. Do not use metallic utensils such as spoons to remove food from your chopper's base as it could damage it. We recommend the KPT silicone spatula to remove food from your chopper's base. Do not use the silicone spatula to remove food from your chopper's blades as the blades could damage the spatula. Use the backside of a knife to scrape food off of blades. You do not need to pull the cord all the way out to get a good chopping result. Over pulling will damage the mechanism over time. Do not keep ingredients like citrus or ginger in the base for more than a day, as this could damage the material. Do not use ice or frozen ingredients as they can damage the blades. Avoid dry or hard ingredients, such as coffee beans, sugar cubes, sea salt, cloves, or star anise, as they can get stuck in the blades and damage the base. And your blades will stay sharp for a very long time, so you do not need to sharpen them. If they ever become dull, it's time to change the blade insert. We do not recommend chopping or blending hot food. 
The supersonic choppers were designed with a tight closure to prevent spillage while chopping. Putting hot food in the chopper creates the risk of pressure buildup, which can be dangerous when opening the container. Always make sure to clean and dry your product before first use. The base, adapter ring, funnel, paddle insert, and bottom part of the cover are all dishwasher safe. However, the blade insert, the anti-skid ring, and the top of the cover must be washed by hand. To keep the blade sharp, wash separately under running water using a brush after every use. For the top cover, clean by hand with a wet cloth after each use. To clean the cord, pull it completely out of the top cover and place it under running water, making pulling movements. Dry afterward using a microfiber dish drying towel. Let the top cover dry completely before reassembling with the bottom cover. Another quick cleaning tip is to pour 150 milliliters of water into the base. Add a few drops of dish soap and blend for 10 seconds. Disassemble the cover, quickly rinse and dry. Always store the blade insert with the blade protector on. Position the blade insert over the pin in the center of the base. Place the funnel inside the base. Place the paddle insert inside with the whisk head facing upward. Place the adapter ring on the base. Then place the cover on top and close. Save time and prep like a pro with the Supersonic Chopper Extra.